LA Workout Apparel, look good while you sweat yourself to help. Many great looks for a beautiful you. Sweat in style and LA Apparel at LUTGRadioNetwork.com. Sweat in style at LUTGRadioNetwork.com. Get your LA Apparel now. Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is the Let Us Thank God LUTG Radio Morning Show with Kathy Brooks. Let's win some souls, play some music, and have some fun in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hey, hey, hey. Amen. Praise the Lord. We're back. Hallelujah. We got the vocabulary word ministry minutes coming up about midway through and uh, the altar call in the last five minutes of the segment. That's my format. We have some music. We have some word, you know, some opinions, some birthdays and whatnot. And then we got the altar call. So it's intro, word, music, altar call. Bada bing, bada boom. That's for somebody out there. And then uh, occasionally, Amen. We'll throw out the weather. Uh, I told you at the beginning of the week that it's going to be warm in Chicago all week. And I told you if you want to know what the weather is like in your area, go to LUTGRadio.com. But I will do my best to remember to not uh, to uh, not to forget the weather. Amen. It's just that I'll be so excited with the things that I'll be talking about, especially when it comes to the word. I do forget sometimes. So this is for all you that want to know what it is like. Amen. In your area, we got Chicago. Ooh, we it's 45 degrees, y'all. For us, that's like summer. Get out of town. Yesterday was about 50 degrees. I saw some kid walking around with his jacket in his hand. Now, you know me being a woman, I'm like, boy, put that jacket on. But well, you know, you can't tell kids that nowadays. I was just thinking to myself, ooh, if that was my child. I don't care if it's 50 degrees out here. You ain't going to be sick because I'm not staying home from work because you could have just kept your coat on. Oh, I think I just had a moment. (laughs) And if you're on the East Coast, oh, we feel for y'all. It's 34 degrees, but you getting used to it. You tough. Go ahead, New York. New York. Amen, amen. All right, in Washington, it's about 38 degrees and, uh, well, it said it feels like 32. Eh, 38, 32, what's the difference, right? All right. I'm just saying. Say so some of these some of these areas need a little bit of humidity. I agree with you. Melt some of that snow. It's springtime, y'all. Next week is going to be the first day. Well, the 21st, that's this Friday, right? 21st is always the first day of spring, right? Then we got Easter, Passover. Speaking of Passover, you guys might want to... Oops. You guys might want to check out a couple of preachers. Uh, Pastor Benny Hinn always gives a good sermon uh, on Passover as well as uh, my girl Paula White. Oh my goodness, I love me some Paula White with her crazy self. Well, I say that in love. Because uh, Paula, no matter, no matter when the odds are stacked against her, she keeps on going. She went, she went and preached at this church. And became the leader of this church when they passed, passed away. And I'm not laughing because of that. I'm laughing because she went into a place where she truly was not liked by the people. According to the comments that were made out there. Now, that may not have been everybody. But it was strong enough that, you know, I guess so-called the leadership or whatever. They wasn't really feeling her. And that's because they were missing their old pastor. I get it. I get it. Uh, and it was probably some of the lay people. Now, I'm just going based off of stuff I heard. I don't know if that's like 100% true. I know she did come on her program and say that, you know, she wasn't really welcomed. But uh, God called her. <laughs> so what does Paula do? She goes and stand on the word and just keeps on preaching the word. She kept her TV program and all the other things that she does for the ministry. I uh, forgot. I just love her spirit. That chick is strong. Uh, 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 she's strong. I don't, I don't know much about her personal life. You know, I heard she got a divorce. Uh, I think that's like online. I was trying to look it up. I really don't like to look up divorces for pastors because I always believe, if for married people, I believe that uh, folks should stay together except for when there's abuse. Um, 
or whatever. So I, I just believe that God will put people together that, you know, what God put together don't let nothing take apart. That's just my belief, but I really don't believe that men and women should beat on each other. And I do mean women beating on men too. Don't do that. It's so disrespectful. And it's disrespectful for, for men to beat on women too. I'm not one to take it. Uh, I, I was in one of those relationships and I fought back. I got tired the first time he hit me. Hello. <laughs> Kathy wasn't going for hit number two. <laughs> I fight back. I can't even apologize for it. My mouth fights back. I try and submit, but it's hard to submit when people are talking against you and saying bad things to you. You're like, hold on. What's up, Jack? What, 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 why are you talking to me like that? Am I? You know, so what it came down to is his friend's girlfriend was doing certain things for him, for them, and they were bragging and saying, how come she doesn't do that? I, I work. They don't. <laughs> so we both going to work. You in the car at the same time that I am. And we both going to work. You get off way before I do. And you go play around. So I'm getting off at what? 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock at night. So you want me to come home and cook you dinner? How about you cook me dinner? <laughs> I'm working 12, 14 hours a day. So... You work at 8 and I'm supposed to come home and cook for you. I, how about you take us out to dinner? You do that. <laughs> well, I'm the one that's paying all the bills. Blah, blah. We split this down the middle. We got equal amounts of bills on both sides. So what's the complaint? You know, so it's all, it was all kinds of crazy stuff like that. And I'm like, dude, do you hear yourself? You know, so... I, I I don't I, I don't I don't deal with that. Not, that's just my personal piece. I don't I don't deal with that kind of crazy stuff. So to all you married folks out there, congratulations to you. To all you want to be married folks out there, take your time. Look, uh, date in a group first to see how people are around other people, and uh, take your time and observe folks. You know what I'm saying? And don't be giving up the cookie. Wait for that cookie. Now I know a lot of women be like, girl, what if he is too small? Oh my goodness. I cannot stand a small skinny one. Oh, goodness. And the dudes are like, man, what if she stank? Oh. <laughs> what if, what if this and what if it ain't right? What if she don't get my motor running? Prayer. Prayer. That's when you go to God. Prayer. <laughs> You'd be surprised when people tell me. But, uh, <laughs> prayer. You gotta pray. Because you've been in trial on too many sticks and too many hats and whatnot. The VJ, the VJ is the hat. So, <laughs> you, you've been on trial on too many of those uh, hats and scarves and, and, and brooms and whatnot and dustpans that uh, don't nobody want you because you know you've tried on too many things too many times yeah so I'm just saying take your time and wait because you are worth it amen if they if they love you they'll wait this goes both ways male and female if they love you they will absolutely wait so all you high school students you college students take your time and figure out who they are definitely don't marry somebody unyoked meaning they must be of the same faith otherwise y'all gonna bump heads all the time Hey man, get you a Christian man, a Christian woman. One that's for real. You know what I mean? Alright, y'all. So that's enough of my soapbox. Mama, mama is done talking. Done telling y'all to take it easy. And they enjoy the ride. Enjoy the dating. You should enjoy courting. Courting, a man courts a woman. But remember, it's the woman that reciprocates. So, men, you can enjoy this courting thing too. You guys are chasing after the women, but the women are the ones that let you catch them. So, both can enjoy. He is hurt by Othello.
incompatible to that of a go by. Load up the info, cause I'm sure to blow the whole spot. Find a man not and invite him to the finest night performance. Up in orthodoxy, follow as I globe try. So hot under the light of the stage. That's what my worries are way into a puddle of what I've been running from. Let's just intensify the atmosphere a little more. I have the mic, so my controller wants to see your hands raised. Almost in a frenzy, exert into your empty. Refuel the fire and climb back into the medley. Grinding as I'm dining on these minimalized designs. In the mind of a madness, I managed to rock steady. You witnessing the pinnacle of rhyme and its medicinal form. Minds are critical, so we perfect every syllable. Shown prone to elevate, lace and animate. Words to merge with thirst and verse form to activate. We run the tables and enable y'all to lose yourselves. Inside of the music, using all we got to give ourselves. So here's a little piece of my soul for all of y'all to contemplate and listen to and hopefully inspire y'all. We took the living, never settle for the status quo. The OP dope they playing on the radio, it's overdose. Rebel music, a chance to shake the industry. The minister administer styles to pound it in. We got hard. The focus is persistence. Hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time. We got hard. The focus is persistence. Hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time. I can't even find the words to describe the feeling that I feel when the syllables tend to ride the rhythm. Walks to the metronome, two step to the breakbeat. Take me to a place where noise has structure in its making of my refuge. Supernatural, see as my flavor has organically years incubating test tubes. I'm a son of Yeshua, this minuscule, I run through you like the fluid that pumps through your veins, inducing movement. When the adrenaline starts pumping through my veins, I'm escaping the stress that I feel daily. I swear lately it's been hard to maintain, but I keep on moving swiftly with persistence of a man who is little but the heart to go the distance. I'm a man of my word, so you MCs observe. I'm a student of the art of pronouns, adjectives, and verbs. I'm known for murder in the rhythm, slice precise vision, divide the lines to get the crowd hype and spread wisdom. We got hard. The focus is persistence. Hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time. We got hard. The focus is persistence. Hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme. Each and every time The heart in my chest pumps some burn-o Lava in my veins, chains, lanes, shift turbo Fuel inject my music with energy from my circle Passion and performance get love wherever the hurt go We kill a combination and shine Raise the level with eternal determination And innovate the stereo box cut The razor blade, lace beats incredible Right, right, we rock mics till the crowd's hysterical Rock, rock, continue We got hard Persistence hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time we got hard. The focus is persistence hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time we got hard. The focus is persistence hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time we got hard. Persistence hard. Boom, that was where the gift is. Start with the fundamentals of rhyme, giving the people energy each and every time. Yeah. 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 Y
send them a letter. If your baby mama need it, go and give her some cheddar. Good deeds equals good seeds, sprouting up good trees. Many second guess, but this is exactly what the hood needs. A hard dose of the truth, I'm screaming from the booth. If you ain't trying to make a difference, go and tie the noose. Your life yours to make, you live, lose, and learn. Just know the path that you take determines what you earn. So plan firm and keep your grind steady. So when your chance come around, you be getting ready. You only live once, that's a true fact. So do the best before you go, ain't no coming back. DSR, young team, Supreme, it's Ray Kills. We trying to conquer the scene. Stress free, no worries. Sun shining when I wake up in the morning. I'm trying to focus, keep my mind up in the zone. And keep everything progressing, rising with it, steady flowing. I know that there's no stopping me. Mind on my grind, so there's no blocking me. Prepare for the future. Touch this.
Amen. Ain't running with my rhythm. Ooh, we I like that. The girl got some good words. Amen. Check out the lyrics. Always, always. Amen. Up next is the vocabulary word right after this quick commercial. Hi, this is Kathy Brock of LUTG Radio, Chicago, Illinois. This is an example of a 15-second commercial. Contact us at lutgradio at gmail.com. Advertise with us today. We want your business. Contact us today. That's right. We want your business. Amen, amen, amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Here is the vocabulary word for you, and it is in Spanish, English and in Spanish. Here we go. In English, it's stay with Jesus, the one who loves you. No matter the struggle, Jesus is your deliverer. Trust Jesus. Uh, it's so interesting when you use that phrase, trust Jesus. In Spanish, it's Jesus trust. Trust. Yeah, they can't make that sound any more Spanish. It's just as it is. Trust Jesus. All right, so in Spanish is estancia con Jesús, el que te amo, no, no importante, la lucha es Jesús su liberat, libertador, Jesús trust, Jesús trust, estancia con Jesús, el que te ama, te, uh, no importante, la lucha es Jesús su Libertador Jesus Trust. <laughs> All right, y'all. So stay with Jesus, the one who loves you no matter the struggle. Jesus is your deliverer. Trust Jesus. Amen. Praise him. That's all I'm saying. Give him some praise. Hallelujah. We had our uh, ministry minutes coming up in about uh, 10, 12 minutes, something like that. Here is Julian Keys. It starts with a dream. Check him out on his Facebook page as well as his website, JulianKeysWorld.com, and let him know that you want to hear him in concert. He's uh, coming back to Chicago in the summer, and uh, tell him you're going to buy his tickets. Amen. This young man can sing. He's a Chicago native, and what do Chicago do? We support our own no matter how far they go. Whether they're in California, the United Kingdom, Italy, Dubai, wherever they are in the world, Chicago got them on lock. Amen. We show them love. Amen. Let's support Julian Keys. It starts with a dream. Don't be afraid of fear. You can conquer anything. Just close your eyes and spark a dream Allow your heart to lead the way And then you see Your dreams become a reality All you gotta do is believe yes. I throw your mind with hope Possibilities be anything you wanna be. Now, can't you see how everything starts with a dream? Keep your aim, yeah, at the prize you're trying to win and claim. When everything don't go as planned, just travel to a place within where no other man can go. You see, be a warrior of the coast. All you gotta do is believe. Yeah. 
Don't let things hold you down. Just take a chance, have faith. Spread your wings and soar. And watch your dreams grow. A place of possibilities. Be anything you want to be. Can you see? Chicago's own Julian Keys. This is Kathy Brox, and here's one of my poems that was set to music. And the poem is called Conversations with God. Key Tronic added some music like the deer. Check this out. He remixed it, y'all. Remix. And I shall never forget you, Lord, the Lord of my birth, the source of my salvation. And I shall never forget you, Lord. The Lord of my birth, the source of my salvation. And I shall never forget you, Lord. The Lord of my birth, the source of my salvation. Let me your seed while you breathe. I am forever thankful.
Ministry Minutes right after this quick commercial. Hi, this is Kathy Brox of LUTG Radio, Chicago, Illinois. This is an example of a 15-second commercial. Contact us at lutgradio at gmail.com. Advertise with us today. We want your business. Contact us today. All right, Ministry Minutes, we are still working on, guess what? Hurt no longer. Beloved, you are lovable. Amen, amen, amen. God dropped that into me a while ago, I should say about a week or so ago, um, but he had dropped the idea in me a while ago, and it has to deal with uh, the body of Christ only loving those that are in their family or those that they like, and uh, oftentimes we won't even offer salvation to people because, well, they don't look clean, or man, they worship the devil, uh, hello, uh, when you're not with God, guess who you're worshiping? So whether they have on the latest outfit or they're sleeping on the ground, if they don't know Jesus, somebody has to tell them, might as well be you. So, uh, and also God was uh, letting me see and reminding me of all the hurt uh, that people have gone through. Often you hear me talk about um, these uh, people that I had known that were hurt uh, in their youth. Uh, some of them were uh, molested. Some of them were beat down to a pulp. Some of them were peed upon. Some of them were killed with their heads bashed in. Some of them were trampled to death. Some of them were just cursed out every day of their life. I mean, there was no physical abuse, but man, did their mind get messed up by all the uh, bad words that were said to them. And uh, some people would go out and they like that so-called pimp mentality. And they like tearing down people because, well, then they get lured over them. And it's kind of like watching a, a dog cower in a corner. Once you've kicked that dog so much and beat him and beat him, whenever you even come their way, they just cower. Like, please don't hit me. But eventually, you beat that dog too much. And it stands. And it gets on all fours. And it leans, it gets into the attack position. And, uh, well guess who's running now and this is one of the reasons why God tells you to uh, not beat upon people but to love them to encourage them to strengthen them and if you are a person that is being beat upon call on Jesus he gives you the strength to say no I don't want this I don't like to be hit I will not tolerate this any longer see making a person weak so you can conquer them it truly is a pit mentality, and it actually makes you a whore of Satan, the, you, the one that's beating on these people. You don't belong to Jesus. You belong to Satan. You're Satan's lackey. You're Satan's dog. So, you know, you got to remember that you as a human being are made in God's image, and you are designed to be the salt of the earth. You are designed to build up. To strengthen. You'll see this in Isaiah 40 and 31, Philippians 2 and 1. Isaiah says, But those who wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. So he's telling you, you don't really need to beat upon people to lord over them or to have leadership, but to show your leadership ability. What you should be doing is loving them. So you get more with honey than you do with uh, vinegar. In Philippians 2, 1 and 3 it says, Therefore, if there is any consolation in Christ, if any comfort of love, if any fellowship of the Spirit, if any affection and mercy, fulfill my joy by being like-minded, having the same love, being of one accord, of one mind let nothing be done through selfish ambition or conceit but in lowliness of mind let them let each esteem others better than himself so what that's saying is get rid of the pride because when you lord over people when you beat upon them you're not doing them any service and you're not doing yourself any service it is better to love than to hate than to hate and it is better to show kindness and mercy and grace 
than it is to beat up on people with a vengeance and you really have no cause because vengeance is never yours. So take God's word, take his burden, it's light, it's easy, and salvation is free. And it's coming up for you in about three or four minutes. Amen, amen, amen. Jesus loves you, beloved, and so do I. Hi, this is Kathy Brox of LUTG Radio, Chicago, Illinois. This is an example of a 15-second commercial. Contact us at lutgradio at gmail.com. Advertise with us today. We want your business. Contact us today. Music Through Love featuring Admiral Bob, amen, and Kara, Kara Square. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Of the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life for God sent not his son into the world to condemn the world but that the world through him might be saved if if you do not know Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior but want to repeat this prayer confession after me Lord Jesus I ask you to forgive me of all my sins I confess my sins before you this day. I denounce Satan and all his works. I confess Jesus as the Lord of my life. Thank you for saving me and for bringing me back to where I once was. From this day forward, Lord Jesus, I will be sensitive to how you feel. I won't hurt you. I will obey you. Lord Jesus, I ask you to present me to Jehovah in your name. Lord Jesus, I believe with my heart, I confess with my mouth that you rose from the dead, that I am saved and receive you today wholeheartedly 100 percent make me a light in a dark place and from this day forward i will leave this place and share you with everyone i meet and everyone i know it's commitment jesus i will get this world for you i pray this prayer to the father in the name of jesus amen 
I received the baptism of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus with evidence of speaking in tongues for the edifying of the body of Christ Jesus by the will of Jehovah God. Amen. Congratulations. Go to LUTGRadioNetwork.com. Click on the link, Find a Church. Get baptized with water. Take your foundation class and your prayer intercessory class. Tell them you got saved on Barack FM. Yeah, Barack is a part of the LUTG Radio Network. Tell them you got saved on LUTG Radio. Amen. Follow me. We got more music coming up for you. Praise the Lord. Amen. And consider becoming a partner of LUTG Radio. And this is how you do it. Hi, this is Kathy Brock of LUTG Radio, the Let Us Thank God Radio Network. I would like to personally extend an invitation to you and ask if you will join forces with us and become a listening partner of LUTG Radio. Your subscription of $17 would allow us to produce bold and energetic programming for the Chicagoland areas such as the My Peace, Birthdays, Vocabulary, and Ministry Minutes segments. Interviews with local musicians, covering concerts and broadcasting of local events, and where salvation is free and offered free of judgment by LUTG Radio daily throughout the year to you, our LUTG Radio listeners. For more information on becoming a listening partner, simply email LUTGRadio at gmail.com or go to the LUTG Radio website. That's LUTGRadioNetwork.com. Again, that website is LUTGRadioNetwork.com. Thank you for all your support and love you've shown us here at LUTG Radio. And we look forward to joining forces with you today. Hi, this is Kathy Brox of LUTG Radio, Chicago, Illinois. This is an example of a 15-second commercial. Contact us at LUTGRadio at gmail.com. Advertise with us today. We want your business. Contact us today.